What is up, ladies and gents? Adam here, returning at last to some more Metal Gear Solid on the PlayStation 1. Last time I played this series was four or five years ago when I never completed it. So today is the day we are going to return to this game. Uh, I am not playing on the PS3 uh, this time around. I am playing it on the duck station emulator so everything's gonna be 4k and all that just the way we all like it graphics are gonna look pretty it's gonna look fantastic so without further ado let's get into it and uh let's get on with the show and of course we haven't read in a while so let's just quickly read this refresh my mind to stop the launch of the new type of nuclear warhead snake must use the detonation code emergency override key at the underground maintenance base up north, or destroy Metal Gear itself. Snake fights Liquid's Hind D on the roof of the communication tower B and defeats it and gets to the snowfield north of the communications tower B. However, Sniper Wolf is waiting for him. After beating her again, Snake and Otacon stay with her until her moment of death. Snake heads for the entrance to the underground maintenance base north of the snow. So, I had to replay through the whole game just to get back to the point we were at. So, of course, I'm so glad to get it going. Uh, I don't have the stuff I had last time, I think. But that's all right. But Sniper Wolf's dead body, so sad. All right, so we're going to just, um, you know... That scared the shit out of me. That's all right. Um, let's just, nope, thermal. Really? Let's try this again. Let's just crawl. Because they clearly don't want me to get this shit. There we go. So yeah, like I said, it's been over like three or four years since we played this. It's kind of crazy. But with the latest news on a rumor remake around the corner and supposedly gonna announce it at the PlayStation Showcase next week, I thought to myself, hey, why not um, finish the story? We're gonna do something Cody couldn't do. We're finishing the story over something years later. It's great. But uh, I'm so glad I'm returning to this game. This game is one of my favorites, and I just had to. I think that's where I gotta go, but let's go over here first. Up oh, there is something over here. Um, there's a surveillance camera. Simple. You really want to get past this shaft grenade, baby. There you go. So I, I, I end up getting uh, rations. Fine. Did not end up getting that. Hold on, let me grab that. The Razapan. Nice, nice. I think we're almost at disc two also, so the one thing that's gonna suck is I'm gonna have We're gonna have to take that. Alright, so Oh shit. Alright. And you know me, I'm not doing this for a stealth playthrough or anything like that. If you want to see that, go to Sinner Strand's channel. Highly recommend it. Shut up. Ow. That's alright. We're fine. <laughs> oh no! I'm on to disc two. Alright, so uh, give me a sec. I'm going disc two right now. Alright, I inputted in my, uh, disc 2, so, let's go. No checking. Good. I'm so excited. I'm like, I've been wanting to play this for a while, and I don't really have the time. 
Now I do. There we go. Plus, this game is a lot of fun. Fine. He's fine. He's taking a nap. I remember this. If you guys want me to play the uh, Trent Snakes, I don't know what killed me. Uh, comment below. I would love to play that one also. Uh, also. It's definitely something on my radar. Alright, so, really, we don't have to worry about this guy, but, I got the silencer. Hey, he's dead. I get more show coming, though. There you go. Damn it. <laughs> I haven't played this in a while, too, so. Snake, Snake. Well, I bet I'm gaining the deaths again. What's that? There. Damn, that can go. There we go. You going over? I know it's gonna move over. Come on. Sweet. So stressful. So iconic music. I heard you. Yeah, you did. <laughs> uh, on, get up. I uh, got stuck. There we go. We're fun. Why well, I'm at it. Why not? What the hell? I do not remember this. I'm getting ammo. Crawl. It's worth it. Oh, whatever. If it's not worth it, then oh, I just did it. So, oh, that doesn't even have effect on me. Cool. Nice. Made it to the next section. When I did this, this was back when I, uh, didn't really name my videos too much. It, it's really crazy how that is, and... I don't know. This was one of my first playthroughs on the channel. I feel like it's worthy of the finish, the story. But anyway, let's just collect the ammo. I don't know if I'm gonna end up playing, uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. Uh, there was rumor on that getting, a. Uh, Remake. Uh, I would want to, but maybe that might be on the stream. 
because that is such a classic game. There he is. Uh oh. Uh, 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 Are you screaming, pal? Damn. Damn. Oh, let's talk about this. Flashing warning, guys. Okay, get up, get up. No, it seems quicker just doing this. It's kind of, you're better off just doing this. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. I didn't know you could toss them over. Oh, come on, I gotta do that again. That's too cool. Oh fuck, I'm missing on. Damn. Ah, oh, it's glad to be back in Metal Gear, guys. Do I gotta see that cutscene again? Playing it smart. When I play it smart, I totally forgot you gotta press the button. And circles to activate it. I don't know what I was thinking. Well, oh, that's get up. Got him. <laughs> Not the way I wanted to go, but hey. It works. Need the key code. Colonel. And uh, I will be making these videos shorter or whatever, maybe? I don't know. I don't remember how I did it, so it's gonna be a lot of fun now. Oh. Oh, fashion. You shit me. Alright, hold on. Uh, night vision. Alright, fine. Let's collect some claymores while we're on it. Fuck it. Chris, <laughs> I'm full on claymore. It's cool. Oh, of course. And, uh, I wonder if they're gonna have it where to grab a claymore, you still gotta do this in the new game, if it's legit. I tell you what, it sure as hell better be. I've been craving my snake. I mean, <laughs> that sounded a lot better in my head. Snake! And, uh, plus, of course, I would like David Hadar. To play Solid Snake. Raven. Pretty cool. I think at the Trin Snakes they attack you. I don't remember. Let's try 
Okay. It's done. Has Tom get in? Oh, here we go. Nice Kodak action. Snake. I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. Naomi. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't worry, the monitor's off. Okay, what's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. What did you say? It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on, even a high school student could see past it. The head of the FBI at that time, Edgar Hoover, he was a well-known racist. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? Yeah. Well, back then, there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 1950s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But... You better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying, and that ninja... Too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? If I find out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Never trust Naomi. I love Naomi. Oh, nothing. I hope they put Melgasol for it on. The thing. Oh. C4. So basically, uh, this just prepping you for the next fight up ahead. Alright, here we go. Now I'm gonna try to be quiet during the cutscenes. Uh, I'm gonna, like, turn my mic volume really down. I hope you can't hear it. There you go. This is the end of the road for you, right, my friends? Listen, they agree. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world, that which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> But that was no true battle. The Ravens and I were testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The Ravens say you are a true warrior. Am I hallucinating? I can't move. The Raven has put the mark of death upon you. Blood from the east flows within your veins. Ah, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. I don't have any crows in my family tree. <laughs> you jest, but indeed ravens and snakes are not the best of friends. Nevertheless, you will make a worthy adversary. You live in Alaska, too. You know of the World Eskimo Indian Olympics? Yeah, I know it. it must be a real threat in the muck duck eating contest. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pull. It is an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different, but the spirit is the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will be a glorious battle. 
This isn't glorious. It's just plain killing. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we'll see if there is iron in your words. Pretty cool. Very cool. Alright, so... Let me, um... Make sure there's no mines. Because if I remember, there was... No. Alright, let me, um... Grab a ration. One way to beat him is uh, either C4 or the Nik the Nikia. Don't do what I do. And uh, there we go. Fuck. All right. That's all right. Don't do what I just did. Damn, it's pretty hard. So. Oh, if you do C4, it's gonna be cold as ice. Oh, never mind. Guess not. Kinda got it. Surprise him. Come on out. Got him. He's being a troll. All right, so there are rations over here, so kind of want to pick that up. <laughs> Try stung. I never really. Got him, I can't see shit. All right, so I'm going to. Please. What's he running off to? Oh. Yeah, this fight can be kind of annoying. Stuck. 
There we go. Now piss off the big goof. Son of a bitch. All right, so. Okay. Fuck, I. Nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Oh, not good stuff. I gotta find some rations quick. Oh, one. At this point, Claymores is your friend. There you go. See, I'm telling you. Oh, nice. We did it. That wasn't that easy. Just as the boss said, it is my existence which is no longer needed in this world. But my body will not remain in this place. My spirit and my flesh will become one with the ravens. In that way, I will return to Mother Earth who bore me. Snake! I will be watching you, understand? Snake, take this security card. It will open that door. Why? You are a snake which was not created by nature. You and the boss. You are from another world. A world that I do not wish to know. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. First, I'll give you a hint. The man who you saw die before your eyes. Beat his subjects down to the blood. So he drained the chief's blood and took it into himself. But he wasn't able to deceive the Angel of Death. The Angel of Death? But why go to so much trouble? Why impersonate the chief? <laughs> that is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. Snake, in the natural world, there's no such thing as boundless slaughter. There is always an end to it. But you are different. What are you trying to say? The path you walk on has no end. Each step you take is paved with the corpses of your enemies. Their souls will haunt you forever. You shall have no peace. Hear me, Snake. My spirit will be watching.
that's some good ration. Okay. Oh, huh. Snake, it's me, Master. It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? <sighs> Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Hmm. So what is this about Naomi? Okay. Maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah. Go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And? There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then, who is she really? She must be some kind of... spy. A spy? Yes. Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. Different group? It couldn't be. Place her under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Uh, nothing. Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. Snake, give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. Oh shit, shot fired. Alright, well, that's gonna be it for this episode of Nogi Solid. Uh, thank you everyone for watching this. It's so glad, I'm so glad to be going back to the series. It's one of my favorite series, and especially with the rumors going around that there's gonna be a new one, a remastered, a remake, or something. I'm all for it. I wanna get this done before then, and then we'll get going on that game too. That'd be a lot of fun. So, like, comment, subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.